Sited on a 16,000 square meter of land in Eteo in LMN local government area is the latest contribution of the Nyesomwike administration in the education sector in River State. The 24 classroom story building with administrative offices, libraries, among other facilities is said to be part of an effort to increase access to quality secondary education. For the special guest, who is commissioning a second project in the state, Governor Nyesom Wike has made the PDP proud by raising the bar of governance in Nigeria. The number of brothers being excluded and commissioned by eminent personalities in River State is a testimony of the de uh, developmental activity, economic and social, being carried out by the governor of this state. Meanwhile, Governor Wike is using the opportunity to challenge the federal government to intervene in some critical federal infrastructure, which he says are in dire straits in River State. Like we said, we are not only focusing on roads, we are also focusing on health, and we are also focusing on education. The Commissioner of Education did say, this of course will improve access to quality education. The chairman of the PDP Board of Trustees then leads others to commission the school. After the commissioning of the secondary school in Eteo in LMA local government area, Governor Wiki then leads the former deputy president of the Senate, Ibrahim Mantu, and other guests to commission a newly built secondary school with modern learning facilities in Obeakbondoki in Oigbo local government area. Like the chairman, PDP Board of Trustees, Governor Wiki is commended by Senator Mantu. Having seen and participated in commissioning these life-changing projects, we are now like Jehovah Witnesses, witnesses of the great strides that the Wiki has taken to transform the lives of the Rivers people from poverty to prosperity. After three weeks of activities, the River State Government says more projects are to be commissioned, while others will be flagged off in the coming days to mark Governor Wiki's sixth year in office and expand infrastructure development in River State.